to Tradespoon. My name is Lark Rappel. I'm CEO and founder of Tradespoon. And today I'd like to go over current market conditions and trade of the week. Disclosures are very important. If you need to trade in stock or options or to Tradespoon, I encourage you to read the disclosures. Pause the screen and visit optionscreen.com so you understand the risk associated with trading stock or options. All right, this is our upcoming webinar on Friday. Hopefully you can make it 9.30 Central. That's the link to register. All right, looking at the stock for Kias Toolbox for today's support, predicted 438, 441. You can see that the bands were constricting, right? Very small difference between predicted low and high. We had a better than expected PPI data, and obviously market uh, overshot the predictions. We we're trading at 450, very strong move to the upside. Close at 448.73. Uh, looking at the six months prediction, model predicted 418 to be the support, 463 overhead resistance. The model is doing a great job. We're already at 450. And it's reasonable to assume that we will get to 463 by either end of November or uh, early first half of December. So I still think it's a pattern of higher highs and higher lows. From seasonality point of view, usually the months of end of November, December is still bullish in the market and we reach it some kind of uh, highs. Uh, so obviously it's a V-shaped recovery, almost without any pause. Market is overbought by any stretch of imagination or any technical indicators that you can look, RSI, MACD, market is overbought, but that doesn't mean it cannot go higher. And the next level of overhead resistance is 453. So meanwhile, market is trading in a new range, 453 is overhead resistance. Support is the breakout, the gap, around 440, 442. Um, I would be a buyer into pullback. I did trim, I actually closed my spider position. I was long spiders in the beginning of November and closed the position because I did reach my target gain. I would consider initiating this position if it does drop back to 440. Uh, all eyes on PPI and retail data. We have retail, uh, Home Depot announced earnings. It was kind of mixed, they down, graded their future guidance, but Mark stock did rally was the rest of the market. We have TJX and some of the Chinese stocks, JD announcing earnings. So it's still important macroeconomic data that can ultimately dictate where the market is heading next. So all eyes on PPI data. And as always, please follow us on social media. We have a, on the YouTube, you can search for the word Tradespoon, our company, Tradespoon. Please click on subscribe and every Wednesday we have a live broadcast and I hope to see you either Friday at the Strategy Roundtable or the live broadcast on Wednesday. Thank you very much and have a great day.